Hello Lakers Nation, my name is Edwin Garcia and welcome back to another edition of Lakers Takes. Today I'm discussing the keys to success for the Lakers in this Phoenix Suns first round series. Before we do that, I need you to do me a favor and like and subscribe to the channel. This channel is just getting started and your help is needed and much appreciated. So if you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Alright, let's get into the video. The Lakers lost game 1 against the Suns 99-90. The game was far from a perfect performance by the Lakers. Their offense struggled, they lacked focus on the defensive end, and they seemed to be unprepared for the intensity of a playoff road game in front of a packed crowd. Let's break down some ways the team can improve moving forward in the series. Chris Paul led teams are usually pretty slow paced. Not the Suns though. They attack quickly and try to take advantage of you with their transition offense. The Lakers will have to do a better job slowing down the Suns if they want to win. The Lakers lost to the Suns three times this year. Twice in the regular season, and in game one. All three occasions had one thing in common. The Lakers lost the rebounding battle in each game. This is to me an example of lack of focus and effort. The Lakers are clearly the bigger team. They should be winning every rebounding battle against the Suns. The bigs need to step up and dominate the boards against DeAndre Ayton and the guards need to do a better job of grabbing any long rebounds. At the end of the day, this team will only go as far as LeBron James and Anthony Davis take it. They have to play better and they have to be the best players on the floor. This means we need a more aggressive Anthony Davis attacking the basket early and not settling for bad mid-range jumpers. We need LeBron to attack the basket as well and get the Suns in foul trouble. LeBron and AD have to produce so much more and they'll have to do it consistently from here on out. The Lakers have a lot to improve on, but it can be done. They were far from their best on Sunday and if LeBron and AD have good games, Lakers win the rebounding battle and just shoot above average instead of awful, they can win their next game and win the series overall. I expect a much better Lakers team moving forward. Let's see what happens in game two and beyond. All right, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed watching, please subscribe and hit that like button. Also comment below and let me know what your keys are to the series against the Suns. Until next time, have a good rest of your day and go Lakers.